back with another plan with me. This is for March 20th through March 26th. We're about to begin our last full week of March. The spring equinox is upon us and as such, I'm going to be using a kit called Spring Cleaning. This kit is from Beautiful Planning. I have a code for you guys, MAMAFRIENDLY15, that'll get you 15% off everything in the shop. And this kit I've had, I believe at the very least, since last year, but it's one of my favorites. I just think it's so cute. I actually I think I used this kit for the first time when we were moving because <laughs> cleaning was a pretty big theme around that time, getting everything set up, not only at the old place, but at the new place. I think this is the absolute perfect week for it because just today is actually the spring equinox. It's the first official day of spring. That to me means out with the old and in with the new. I've been deep cleaning my house for about the last two weeks and if you've been following my vlogs you know that I've been decluttering at least one item a day. At this point I think I'm averaging more like six to ten items a day but I'm trying to declutter at least one item a day every day in my home. I've been doing it since November 27th of last year in the hopes that if I stick to one item a day and like I said I've been doing way more than that I will have gotten rid of 400 items by the time January 1st, 2024 rolls around. I have a whole playlist of decluttering stuff, so I'll post it up here in the corner in case you're interested. But for now, let's talk about what we're working with this week for our stickers. As usual, I did the crop method. That just means that I didn't want to print every single sticker and then be left with a bunch of extras that I wasn't going to use. So I smushed all the ones that I was going to use or that I think I might use onto as few sheets as possible. So I'm saving on ink, I'm saving on paper, I'm saving on time cutting, and like I said, as few pesky little leftovers as possible so that I eventually don't have to declutter them. I've thrown out so many remnants of sticker sheets in the last couple of months, it's kind of wild. So to start, we have our full boxes up here. We have our bottom washi, which is almost just like a woven carpet type feel, and I really, really love that. Very simple, but it's effective, right? Like it gets to the point. Very spring, nice clean carpets. I love it. And I did do just a double of this side so that I wouldn't have to mess around trying to make two stickers fit together over here. And now on my second sheet, I've got my days and my date covers to cover up all this stuff. I've got glitter headers. Have I got enough here? Yes, I do. Okay, I was worried for a minute that I didn't have enough of the blue ones. We've got habit trackers. We've got a longer full box for my sidebar. My weekend banner, some deco, and we have these YouTube stickers. Now these aren't part of the kit. They're their own separate sheet of stickers, but you can still get these at Beautiful Planning Shop if you want. I like to use these stickers every week to let you all know what I'm planning to post on my channel on any given day so that if there's something in particular that sounds fun to you, you know when to come back. Now that all of that is handled, let's go ahead and start. You guys know I like to start with my bottom washi. I kind of frame both pages and then work on the center. So bottom washi it is trying to find the bottom of the page and kind of use that as my guide because lately I've been doing this really really crooked <laughs> and uh, it's been affecting kind of like how all the other stickers lay as a result so that first one seemed to go down pretty well this one's looking nope this one's looking like if I'd have stayed on that trajectory I would have regretted it it's a good thing I caught it when I did, even though I fully ripped the paper. Hopefully nobody will notice. It'll be our little secret, right? Da, 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 da. Okay, that's as good as it's gonna get, I think. That turned out pretty good. Let's move on. Actually, let's go ahead and put down our weekend banner, because why not? We're already here. We'll put that right there. Apparently, I might be wrong, but I'm pretty sure um, this week is spring break for the local schools anyway. I wouldn't know because we homeschool, but um, good to know. We already went to the zoo last week, so we don't have to worry about running into the spring break crowd out there this weekend because we already got that out of our system for a little bit. 
that's pretty much all spring break means to me is, oh, stay away from all your usual haunts because they're going to be packed. And then I know once spring break is over, it's back to normal. And uh, we can assume that things are not going to be as crowded. Very cute, very cute. Got my habit trackers down. Did everyone have this feather duster growing up or was that just my family? Obviously not because it's popular enough that it made it into this sticker art. But yeah, this like really long rainbow colored feather duster. I feel like every household in the late 90s had this. Let me know if, uh, <laughs> if you can relate. So now, I'm not sure what I want to put. Hmm. I kind of really love this mop with all of the cleaning supplies because it really like drives home the whole spring cleaning thing. But I feel like besides the two fashion girls, nothing else really feels very spring cleaning about the art. And so on the one hand, I kind of don't want to waste this. But on the other hand, we're better to put it than where it's going to be kind of um, on display, you know, like prominently. So I think decision made. I'm gonna go ahead and put the mop right there. That's kind of perfect, honestly, for a spring cleaning kit. So now, what's next? We gotta put down our numbers for our dates. I don't know why I printed my, the this week sticker because I never use it. I guess I just forgot to get rid of it. It's no big deal. It's not taking up too much space or anything. Do, 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 do. Putting on my dates, trying to remember if there's any birthdays this week. And no, I don't think there are. There's birthdays next week, and there were birthdays last week, but none this week. So now that I've got that down, I'm gonna go ahead and put my dates down, I'm gonna put down my glitter headers, and I'll meet you all back here in just a minute. All right, pallies, we've got our framework down. Loving the colors. They absolutely scream spring to me. So we're gonna move on to our full boxes now. And you guys know I like to space out similarly kind of like themed stickers. So I'm going to make sure to put a fashion girl kind of like every few days so that they're set up apart but still in a way where like, I just want the eye to bounce around instead of everything being clustered together. So I'm gonna put that one over there because she also has a little rainbow duster. So the rainbow dusters are gonna be as far apart away as they can be. And then this other girl is gonna kind of be in between the two. If I could get this to lay down, not crooked. That'll have to do. <laughs> So now, you know what? Monday with a coffee, I like it. I'll go ahead and start that way. Mm, maybe down here. Okay, that works. So then for Tuesday, we'll do, I don't know what's the point of the boba and the, and the purse as far as spring cleaning, but whatever. Somebody's aesthetic, I'm sure. Oh boy. We'll put this right there. The bottom ones are always tricky because my mind doesn't know whether I should use the bottom washi as a guide or the glitter header. The glitter header is what makes the most sense because you want it to line up like a column here, but somehow I still always manage to stuff it up the first time. So let's try that again. We were granted 
a second chance. So let's try our best with it. Okay, that's better. I'm happy with that. Sweats on Saturday. Sounds good to me. And our cute little reed diffuser. And what's that, a candle? Sure, on Friday. Nice. So the last thing I wanna share with you guys before we wrap this up, since like I said, we're not gonna be doing any, um, we're not gonna have any birthdays this week, is of course the YouTube stickers. So for today, you've got this planner video that you're watching right now. For tomorrow, you're gonna have a vlog that I recorded over the weekend. Lots of stuff going on around the house and whatnot, so if you wanted an update on that, that's happening Tuesday. No new video on Wednesday. On Thursday, if all goes to plan, because I have a lot of editing I need to do, we're gonna have the monthly Disney homeschool video. Uh, you guys might know, I've been doing Disney homeschooling for years, but for this year in particular, we're doing the Epcot World Showcase as our inspiration for all our lessons. So I've been going around the entire World Showcase, just like you would at the park, like in that same order. And we're already by the United States, which I believe is kind of wrapping up the first half of the countries. Like we're pretty much halfway done with both the school year and the curriculum. So that's gonna be coming out on Thursday. And then on Friday, we're gonna have another vlog. And this is a vlog that I'll have been recording over this first half of the week. So that's pretty much everything. I hope you guys have a great spring equinox. I hope that um, the spring treats you well, treats you gently. Happy to put winter behind us. It was a long, long, long winter. <laughs> and um, yeah, I'm just ready for everything to be clean and fresh and new, both the things around me and hopefully the things within me as well. So that's what's going on for this week. I wanna thank you all so much for being here and watching this video. I hope you enjoyed it. And if you did, I hope you'll please give it a big thumbs up. I'd also love it if you'd subscribe and click that notification bell because I post at least three times a week and I wouldn't want you to miss a minute. Thanks so much again for watching. Bye.